Well, with my newfound life, I now wake up at 6 in the morning every day and I try to be at the gym or doing some sort of workout by 7 a.m. Before, I would be coming home at 5 a.m. from the club usually and sleeping at 6 in the morning. So my life completely turned around. It's like a new time zone. Never. Um, I used to not take any meetings before lunch, before my day usually would start at noon and my first meeting would usually be at 1 p.m. and then I would fill my days with meetings and then fill my nights with social gatherings, whether it's a dinner, a party, an event. Um, I always made sure my calendar was full and working out or fitness was never a part of that old schedule. Whereas now, I really make it a priority to wake up in the morning, create time for it, and you know, it's, it's made me feel so good about myself and I don't regret it at all. Go to sleeping position, I usually need pillows on like one of each side. So I usually like, I need a pillow, I'm usually on the side. Right now, I have a book called Option B and I have a book called um, Sweet Bitter and both books have been getting a lot of good reviews and I've been meaning to read them so I'm gonna start this week, I promise. It's a long one. <laughs> um, nighttime regimen. I usually um, clean my face so I wash it, I moisturize. Um, now that I'm 33, I need to start putting serums and creams and all these things to make sure that I don't regret it in the future if I ignore my, my skin now. Um, so I'm vain in that sense. I like to take care of my skin. Before I go to bed, I, I need to make sure that everything is clean. No. Not on the bed. Before I go to bed, I usually am just on my phone. I usually would be texting someone or I'd be on Instagram or Facebook. Um, if I really need to go to bed, if I have jet lag or if I'm traveling, um, I usually take a melatonin. Um, I don't snack anymore, especially at night. Um, but if I do get hungry, um, let's say you know I'm, I'm in a red-eye flight or I just landed and I need something, um, Peanuts, almonds, cashews, things of that nature. It's really my time to reflect. So I usually think about the day that was and I think about what I plan to do tomorrow, the day ahead. So I usually take time, um, that's when I write down on my notes like what I want to achieve for tomorrow. And usually that's what I, when I cross off things on my to-do list, what I've done during the day. So as much as possible, everything on that to-do list must be ticked off. If not, I'll carry that over to the next day, but I try not to do that as much as possible. Um, I do sleep with my dog, Presley. So I have a black Afghan hound. Her name is Presley. And before, I could, she could never sleep on my bed because she would make a mess. And you know, puppies are usually so hard to train, especially the breed that I have. Um, so recently, just a few weeks ago, she's managed to stay on the bed without making a mess. So now she's getting used to sharing the space with me. She understands that it's a bed and you don't make a mess on it. So I usually sleep with my dog on my bed. I'm currently swim training. So I think I was swimming in my dreams last night because I knew that 6 in the morning today I had swim training. So. I think I was dreaming about the upcoming race that I'm joining, so it's kind of like giving me slash nightmares. <laughs> <laughs>